eyes only for the mind body project welcome back day number four so 10 misconceptions about weight loss yeah so we're continuing on with that right so today is you need willpower to succeed so that's the common thing people believe they need willpower to succeed in weight loss if you are using willpower for me then you've set your goal completely wrong and you're not going to last very long. Willpower is not how it works. Yeah. If you're doing something that is painful to you, you don't last very long doing it because your brain is just hardwired to avoid pain. Yeah. It's a survival mechanism. Yeah. That's what it's going to do. If you're in pain as you're doing this. Now you can temporarily, you can as long as the goal is set in a really good way. So temporarily, um, you can. And there's there's certain things in my head is such as good pain, but then there's also bad pain. But if you set your goal wrong, then you're gonna be using willpower. So if you're say if your goal is something like I want to lose two stone by say March, then you're, if that's your goal, if that's all you're focused on, you're going to have to use willpower to do it because you haven't set your goal as something as pleasurable. It's not pleasurable, that. Um, and it's not the right focus, as I spoke about in video number um, one, is you need to get to your highest intention. So willpower is not going to be happening. Loads of people talk to me about motivation. I'm not motivated, I'm not motivated. You're always motivated. But you're either motivated by two forces to get away or avoid pain or go towards pleasure. That's the only two things. So how you set this all up, this thing about weight loss, which I say look good and feel good, because that's a better way of looking at it than weight loss. If you set it up that way, then it's pleasurable. If you set it up as weight loss, it's usually pain. And that's why people will struggle with it. They'll only last about, what, 12 weeks, as I mentioned in the last video about a plateau. They'll get to a plateau and then they'll go, ah, it's not working anymore, I'll give up. Yeah, because why am I doing this painful thing if it's now not working? I'm not getting the results either. So after about, it's usually about three months when people give up, unless you set things up in the right way. It needs to be, and, and that's the thing, 80% of this is mindset. And if you don't set things up in the right way and know what's coming down the path and know what to expect, then people ain't gonna be successful at it.